video discusses topics that may be disturbing to some viewers. It discusses cases of missing and or murdered victims whose case was solved using forensic genetic genealogy. Viewer discretion is advised. In the cold of December 6, 1993, a land surveyor found the body of a female who was at the base of a tree in Centerville, Virginia. At the scene, there was some jewelry a red comb, a yellow barrette, and deteriorated clothing. The medical examiner and experts determined that the body was that of a female roughly 28 to 39 years old that suffered from a stab wood to her upper body. Using advanced DNA science and forensic genetic genealogy provided by Authorum Labs whose funding was provided by Deanna Solvers. After the sample was sequenced it went to the forensic genetic genealogists who were able to connect to a brother of the Jane Doe who in turn informed Authorum Labs that his sister whom was estranged from her family had two children. One of her children was tested and the Jane Doe was able to be identified as Sharon K. Abbott Lane. Sharon K. Abbott Lane was believed to be living in Fairfax County, Virginia prior to her body being found on that December day. She was originally from the Georgia area. After her initial disappearance, an anonymous phone call was placed to her late father that his daughter was dead. The voice on the phone was a female. At the time of her disappearance Sharon had two kids and was separated from her husband who had custody of the kids and is not suspected to be involved. As far as anyone knows there was not a missing person report taken as her family thought she would reconnect with them down the road. Major Ed O'Carroll of the Major Crimes Cyber and Forensics Bureau said that they are continuing to investigate this case and asks that if anyone has any information on this or asked to call Crime Solvers at 1-866-411-TIPS or the Fairfax County Crime Solvers website.